Hello, Internet friends. Chris Masto here. Super quick video. I just wanted to do, I don't know if I'd call it a review. Maybe it's more of a first impression type of video of this product here, the SensePeak hands-free oscilloscope probe system. Uh, I saw this on the EEV blog video a while ago, and I got one, and it's been kind of sitting here for an opportunity to actually use it. So I hadn't used it before, but today I had an opportunity to use it. I tried it out, and I figured I would give you uh, my quick first impression of it because uh, turns out it's pretty cool. So what the heck am I talking about here? Well, let's say you have, you know, a board that you are trying to probe. And, uh, you know, this is a classic problem we all have, right? You're trying to get in there with your oscilloscope um, and hold it steady in one place while you're looking up at the screen and maybe adjusting some knobs and making some measurements. It's very difficult to do, even on, uh, you know, chunky components. But uh, if you got something like this, I mean, this board here, that's a uh, QFN with a 0.5 millimeter pitch. So it's hard enough, uh, practically impossible to even hit those pins, let alone hold the probe on them without screwing up. Um, so what they've done here um, is, uh, first of all, you get this, this magnetic surface here that you can stick things on. And they have, for example, these board holders. So you have nice little springy board holders there with insulators on them. And uh, you can stick these anywhere on this work surface, which is pretty convenient to start with. And then um, the clever bit is that you also get these uh, probe arms. I don't know what you'd call them exactly. Floppy arms, tentacles, holders. And they have a magnetic base. So you, again, you put that anywhere on the board, but then you attach your, your probe to the end of that. I guess it's PC byte is what the... Uh, name it. I don't know. I didn't look up the name, um, so I'm probably calling it the wrong thing, but it's from these folks. Uh, PC Byte, I guess is what it's called. So um, the idea, though, is that, first of all, this has got a good amount of weight to it, and however they've manufactured this, uh, the, these tentacle arm things, they tend to stay put wherever you put them. So, uh, and this doesn't even have anything attached to the end, and it's on a slippery desk, but you can see how, if I position this somewhere, it pretty much doesn't move. Um, and then when you combine that with the actual probes, if you attach the probe to the end of that, that has a, a really sharp pogo pin uh, tip on there, then you can attach this to your to your board. No, I'm, uh, I'm even jiggling this with my finger here. And that stays where you put it extremely well. So um, here I have a microscope view, as you can see a little better. Um, so I've, I'm probing that pin there, and I've just stuck the, the pointy, sharp um, pogo pin into the, the solder there on that pin, and it isn't going anywhere. So then you can let go, and you can go ahead and you can make your measurements or do whatever else you have to do. Uh, it's, it's really clever, um, and it's surprising. You might, this is the kind of idea that I wouldn't think would work because it's sort of relying on, on friction and magnets and this, this being exactly right in such a way that it doesn't, it doesn't want to pull away from where you leave it, but it doesn't. Um, and of course, you know, you make sure to put the base so that you have, have the right angle there to make it maximum, uh, maximally sticky, but that is, uh, that is a very difficult thing to do by hand, if not impossible, and this system allows you to do it. So I was impressed. Uh, that's, I guess, the PC Byte um, hands-free oscilloscope probe from uh, SensePeak. Uh, you know, I haven't used it for anything more complicated. I think I got a couple of probes, and um, these are the the high bandwidth, um, the 200 megahertz oscilloscope probes. They also have just like multimeter probes that are a lot cheaper. Um, and so you you know, if you have to probe some complicated signals. You can do it, and that's that's it. Just wanted to um, mention that because I had it uh, pulled out here to use, and and wanted to let you know how what I think of it. Oh, the other thing too, um, I have it on this uh, uh, microfiber cloth because the underside of this it's got two surfaces here. So there's the 
the matte one, I think it comes with a sticker that you can put on there, and I put the sticker on. And then they have the mirror finish on the other side. So if you have a board where it would behoove you to be able to see the reflection of the bottom side of the board, um, you can you can use the mirror finish side, which is kind of clever too. Um, so anyway, that's, that's what this is all about. Um, working great. I like it. See you in the next one.